Hello, I am Anthony Delaney and I'm a senior from Lincoln High. And this poem is called Mini Me. They call me the mini him. He says mini me, I say me. But they emphasize mini him like it's something I asked for. Father dearest, let his life go swirling down the drain of the toilet bowl like last night's vomit. He drained himself of humanity. You see, he had an addiction for something that could feel more real than the reality. Of laying his own future on the chopping block. It was only when the cuffs clinked and his head thunked face down on the hood that he realized it was too late to fix what he'd broken. He spent the next few years in a cell. Never mind food for thought, all you've got is silence. Father dearest, did you know what she was doing to your mini-me? For the next few years I was raised by my grandmother and her misguided mind. She says she saved me from a household of drug trafficking and beer-stained carpets. My first rattle came from a beer glass shard in my foot infected and I kept hearing this crack baby can't hack it so let's start building him a casket and her way of raising me was by the fly swatter imprints on my back and the belt buckle shapes I traced my fingers around the next day at school father dearest did you know what she was doing to your mini me I hear you look just like your dad you talk just like your dad you walk just like your dad you act just like your dad repeated back to me a reason to why I had to pay the price because grandma couldn't get to you but she could get to me and under the terms of custody with father, they just look like new chains locked tightly away with the key of his own fear. Fear doesn't know itself, so it dances atop the mini-me's frame, hanging in every lecture like a reflection of what will be doomed to repeat history. You see, it's a soft reminder that the same blood boils at the same temperature and temperaments were never high enough for me to say what needed to be said. I wanted to fight because the shackles made from the iron of my blood grew rusty as I grew restless high. I held back because there was a shadow of his mistakes over mine. And sometimes it's hard to remember, but I know that this is a man who lost everything in exchange for nothing. Who built himself up again brick by bloody brick. This is the man who with a nightly shift couldn't close the rift between father and son, but he could put clothes on my back and a roof over my head. This is the man who, when I'd lost my bike in the river, him, pneumonia ridden, waded chest deep into the freezing water to find a bike I'd let rest to nothing. This is the man who, despite every setback in me, sees someone who can dream deeply and freely, and in every exhale of my breath, release those dreams made real. So when the grass-smelling, yellow-tipped green grows over his grave, the lessons learned will always be here. But never again will someone look like me, talk like me, walk like me, act like me. And Dad? I will always be your mini-me.